find phi inverse of 0 0.966. So here we have to find phi inverse of this. So now you look for a value closer to this over here. So value closer to 0.966 is it lies between these two. You take the smaller one that is 0.9664. This is present at 1.83. Okay, more. To this, I should add two more. Only then the result will be exactly same as this. So to add two more, you look for two in the same row. So we have two here present for the number three. So now three will become your third decimal. So this is your answer for this one. Okay, next. Phi inverse of 0 0.9871. We have to find phi inverse of this. So now you look for a value closer to this over here. So closer to 0 0.9871 is 0 0.9871. We have exact value man 0 0.9871. This is present for 2.23. Okay. Since we got exact value, we will not get the third decimal. So this is the answer for this one. Okay. Next. Phi inverse of 0 0.9927. So now you should look for a value closer to this over here. So value closer to 0 0.9927 is we have exact value present at 2.44. Okay. Since we got exact value, we will not get the third decimal. So this is the answer for this one. Okay. Am I clear?